Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I want to spend a couple of minutes um, talking about why life with uh, our life being in a wheelchair or having some kind of physical handicap that impairs your walking is hard. So um, let me spend 30 seconds trying to count out some ways why this kind of life is a little bit more arduous. Okay. So let's begin. Um, reaching shelves that are higher for you, ramps versus stairs, elevators versus stairs, opening and shutting doors, looking through the people when people come to your house, getting inside and outside of car, into and out of cars, um, sitting where you want to sit in the in the theater. Um, going into and out of um, buildings or um, buildings or offices or houses. Yeah, so that's what I came up with. Now let's talk about them for a little bit. So I pretty much dealt with every one of them. Um, the first one is, so if you're in a wheelchair, um, you can't really, whether it's in your house, putting your clothes away or re putting um, things in the pantry, you can't really reach up if you have a balance problem like me or if you're confined to a wheelchair. Um, everything needs to be within your reach. Um, another one is elevators. Um, my friend touched upon this too in her interview um, for me that um, when you go out, you have to, if the uh, mall that you're going to or the store that you're going to doesn't have an elevator, if you can't go upstairs, that's a little problematic. Um, also, when I lived by myself in Chicago a couple of years ago, one thing that was very hard was um, when I had to leave the house. So right now I'm I'm uh, mobile. I try to um, get around by walking, but um, that's not the safest mode for me. And outside of my apartment, um, I had a wheelchair that I used when I used to go around and I used when I used to go around the city. So when I used to go, it used to be take a, a long time for me because um, one hand would carry the thing I needed, the other hand I would use to maneuver. So in one trip I would take my keys, come back. Next trip, take my phone, come back. Then I'd take another trip, a snacks because I need to eat every two hours, come back water bottle, go, come back, um, my purse and a jacket. So I had to make a lot of um, trips that usually a person who doesn't have to deal with this kind of issue can kind of accommodate all that in one trip and doesn't have, it won't be as time consuming. Another thing is I remember when I was in college um, the building that I had to go to had a flight of stairs, like three, four steps that I could just go down and then take a left and go into the building for class. Versus, if I wanted to be more safe, I would have to take a detour um, to take the ramp of about, uh, I would say, 30 odd steps and then go down the ramp to go into class. Now, me, because I am very I don't like wasting time and I'm always in a rush to get things done and go places. Um, I did and I will take the steps. So that's um, in a limited time, that's the things that I can think of that make our lives a little bit more arduous. Um, reach out to me, let me know in the comments below uh, what else you can think of. And I hope to hear from you guys. Thanks.